UK to the small cave. What time is it? Oops, it's not the time button. How do I? Oh crap! That's... I didn't know you could change that. Okay, speed is what I want. Currently, I'm a bit slower than all because I'm satiated and being full makes you roly poly and um, slower. Oop, now I'm bloated, now I'm a bit slower again. Um, hmm. Oh great, it's pitch black. That movie, if that movie has taught me anything, it's that you don't want to be in a dark room alone. So, okay, let's, let's open up this door, and let's open up this door, and let's kill this cobalt, and it's all a flail. Picking up all sorts of really cool weapons and not looking at them or trying them out because chances are the first thing I equip will be some crappy thing that will just ruin everything for me. But now I want to try. I'm going to take off my heavy club and I'm going to risk it and put on this halberd. Off defense, yes, that was a good choice. Holy crap. I must have picked this up in the the small cave because it is really over-leveled for me. It gives me an extra 18 defense value. So, I am I am a god now. I can't be hit, and I will do crap loads of damage. 15 bonus to hit, 2d7 plus 11 damage. That is a lot. Um, so yes, next, next thing I run into will die immediately. Ooh, and we might be running uh, a bit low on time. Let me just check. Looks like it. So, okay, join me next time when we uh, continue with a successful character for once. Okay, so I let that one run over a little long. And uh, hopefully you guys didn't mind the rather poor cutoff I'm sure is going to be uh, edited in there. Still going around finding locked doors at every turn and I'm just waiting for one of them. <coughs> Excuse me. Just waiting for one of them to have some sort of explosive trap. But instead we are greeted with the side of a pool. And I definitely want to go and drink from it. Well, it's not a great great idea, but oh crap. Yes, that door fell on me. That can be bad. I do want to go and drink from that pool because I love to risk my life when it's not necessary and this is ant country. Close it all. Yep. I also want to find the downstairs so that I can get out of here when I'm ready. Come here. I feel flexible. Oh, that's good. I feel inflexible. That's crap. Yay, I suddenly remember my early youth. I think that means that if I had been magically aged, it would de-age me. I feel flexible again. Oh, I'm getting a cold. I don't know what that means. I hear a voice calling me Iceberg. Uh, that is a reference to something. Oh, I'm depressive. Oh, no, I don't want to be depressive. I think that makes me unlucky. Which, in this game, is a very, very bad thing to be, because you're pretty much by default screwed, and then when you get bad luck in-game, it just puts everything against you. The random generator is going to spawn dragons where dragons shouldn't even be. It won't actually do that, but it will spawn, I don't know, level 30 stuff on top of me. Alright, so we're on the third level of the pucky part of the puppy cave, and I found a tension room. Oh, an egg kick breathes a stream of acid at me. That's, uh... Yeah, I don't know how, how I feel about that. 